everybody, Ginger Shadow here, and uh, welcome to something I imagine nobody saw coming. I mean, I did mention the fact that I would considered making one of these a while back, but I don't think anyone expected to actually fall through and make it here today. Welcome to the Epic MMO Mod Pack Server Series thingy magic. I'm, I'm just calling it an Epic MMO at this point, mainly because it's got Epic fight mod and MMO mods in it. It's on point sixty point five. It's got a bunch of fun mods in it. And fans to give it a go. Plus I've got the server sitting there doing nothing so something with it. Also yeah this mod's in which people have been saying to do with things for a while. So here we are trying it. Origins mods. Oh, oh it looks like an interesting mod because you start with well you can just be a regular human but also you can start with different species of things which have got pluses and minuses to them. So um I figured I could start just by picking one, but I figured I'll run through them all quickly just so everyone can see them. And then, and, I don't know, people can go to comments what the one they think it should have been. I don't know if you can change it later, but... Anyway, right. Welcome, welcome. What race are we going to be to start us off, then? We've got regular human. No thanks. The avian. Race has lost the ability to fly. A long time... Oh, next. No, okay. Um... The creatures can be seen peacefully gliding while placed on, so it's got slow fall. Feather weight, you fall as gently to the ground as the feather would unless you sneak. Cool. Fresh air. When sleeping, your bed needs to be at an altitude of 86 blocks so you can breathe fresh air. Tailwind. You're a little bit quicker on foot than others. Cool. Oviparous. Whenever you wake up in the morning, you will lay an egg. Uh, uh, vegetarian, you can't digest any meat. That doesn't bother me because I eat potatoes a lot of the time anyway. Arachnids. The claimed abilities are the ability to trap their foes in the spider web, make them arach make the arachnid perfect hunters. Climbing. You're able to climb on any kind of wall, not just ladders. Master of web. You never get caught by perfectly and you're able to climb in them. When you hit an enemy in melee, they get stuck in cold web for a while. Not a rack uh, rac arthropods stuck in cold webs will be sensed by you. Interesting. You're able to craft cold web from string. Carnivore, your diet is uh, restricted to eat. You can't eat vegetables. Fragile, you have three less hearts than human. I suppose there's a lot of positives there. <laughs> like eating meat's not too big a deal. But yeah, okay, so basically you've got a sense for when someone's trapped in a web. And okay, that I wasn't actually thinking about becoming an arachnid before, but now I'm thinking about it. That is some pretty good benefits. And like eating meat, again, I can sit on a diet of vegetables, but I can also equally sit on a diet of killing cows, so... But him, so that's heart, so that's a bit of a thing. Um, Electrian. 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 Often flying around the, in the winds, Electrians are uncomfortable when they don't have enough space above their head. Wing, do you have an Electro wings without needing to equip any? Okay. Gift of the winds. Every 30 seconds, you are able to launch about 20 blocks into the air. Hey, you'll come, uh, come in. You deal substantially more damage while in Electra flight. Need for mobility. You cannot wear any heavy armor. Armor with protection values higher than chainmail. Claustrophobia, being somewhere with a low ceiling for too long will weaken you and make you slower. Brittle bones, you take more damage from falling and flying into a box. <laughs> like a bird then. A shock, a shock, a shock. Ladies to the shocklers, the bodies of the shocks are outfitted with protection shell like skin. Shock levator, you have access to an additional nine slots of inventory. Which are, uh, keep the items on death. Sturdy skin, even without wearing armor, your skin provides natural protection. Strong arms. You're strong enough to break natural stone without the use of a pickaxe on wheel day. You, the way your hands are formed provide no way to hold a shield upright. Ah, I like shields though. Large appetite, you exhaust much quicker. Yep, nope. <laughs> nope, nope. I already think food's annoying enough as it is. Uh, with their cat-like appearance, the feline scare creepers away. With the extent of cats, they always land safely on their feet. I don't, uh... Acrobatics. You never take fall damage, no matter how far height you fall down. That's good. Uh, Strangles, you're able to jump higher by jumping while sprinting. That's good. Nine lives, you have one less heart. Oh, wait, what? You have one... Oh! Neat. I just hear noises in the background. You know, my character's probably staying in the middle of the field right now. I just hope I don't get killed. <laughs> uh, you have one less heart than humans. Uh, weak arms. When you're not under the effects of strength potion, you can only mine natural stone. If you are most two other natural stone blocks adjacent to it. Wait, you can only mine natural stone if there are at most two other natural stone blocks adjacent to it. 
Okay, that one. I can't like appearances. Creepers are scared of you and will only explode if you attack them first. Nocturnal. You can slightly see in dark when it, not in war. Okay. Endrian. Born as sons and daughters of the Ender Dragon. Eldians are capable of teleporting but are vulnerable to water. Teleportation whenever you want. You can throw an Ender Probe, which deals no damage, allowing you to teleport. Hydrophobia. You receive damage, time while connected with water. Wait, does that mean you hurt by rain? Uh, you are afraid of pumpkins for a good reason. Okay. Cool. Slender body. You can use blocks and enemies fall away. That's a lot of good benefits there. I mean, sucks if you like swimming, but... A merling. These natural inhabitants the ocean... Uh, these natural... These natural inhabitants of the ocean. Uh, can we use... Uh, oh. And I don't use being out of water for long. Gills, you can breathe underwater, but not on land. With eyes, your vision underwater is perfect. Aquafini, you may break blocks underwater as fast as you do land. Fins, your underwater speed is increased. Lake water. When underwater, you do not sink to the ground unless you want to. So you're a fish. Makes sense. All right. Uh, Blazeborn. Like the center of the blaze. The Blazeborn are naturally immune to the perils of the nether. Fire immunity. That speaks for itself. Uh, nether inhabitant. Your natural spawn will be in the nether. <laughs> oh, God. Uh, when on fire, you deal additional damage. When you're attacked, caught bloody due to your hot body. Venom burns up, making you immune to poison. And hunger status effects. Hydrophobia. You receive damage and time in the water. That's pretty good as well. It's a lot of benefits just for not being able to swim. Phantom. Half human, half phantom offspring. I don't want to know how that came about. These creatures can switch between a phantom and a normal... Oh. Translucent. Your skin is translucent. Phasing. While phantomized, you can walk through solid materials like obsidian. Except obsidian. Invisibility. While phantomized, you're invisible. Uh, photoallergic. You begin to burn in daylight if you're not invisible. Fast metabolism. Being uh, phantomized causes you to become hungry. Fragile. Yes, so you less hearts and humans. Random! Wow, okay. Oh, there's a few good ones in here. The avian's quite... Alright. The arachnid's quite cool. Don't really care for that one as much. Nope. Uh, feline's quite good. Enderling, no. The blazeborn's pretty good, but no, I don't want to be in the nether. And the phantom's not bad, but I think I'd get annoyed being a vampire. Like, having to do things for the skin. Uh, not taking fall damage. One less heart. The stone thing. Ah, the stone thing I think gets me in that one. I don't think it's been the arachnid. I think we're going to go in arachnid. I'm going to be reborn as a spider. I have three less hearts than humans. I'm so good at it. Ah! Oh, God! Ah! <laughs> I wonder what the background noise was. Oh, God. My endurance went up during that as well. Oh, wow. Fucking hell. Leave it alone! Ah, oh, the automatic jump's on! No! <laughs> no! Oh, wait. Oh, yeah, the automatic jump is on. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it so much. And there we go. Right, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Wrong one. Controls. Get off. Get that off! Bad! There we go. <sighs> right! <laughs> How am I dealing with this then? <laughs> ah! The hell was that effect? Leave me alone! What if I spawn there? I don't know! Ah, I'm about to die. I've caught one in my web! And I'm dead. Right, well, they'll Fucking. No! 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 No, this is unfair. I, I spent. Because I spent so long <laughs> doing the intro bit. Going through all our options. <laughs> I'm never going to deal with all the monsters. I haven't even got to through all the mods yet. I mean, you could probably guess some of them, but still. How do I take for... Oh, wait, that's my Feck off! Ah! Leave me alone! At least my endurance is going up, eh? Hey. Ah! No. One of these points or another will get away from them and it'll all be good. One of these points will get away from them and it'll all be fine. I think we've gotten away from them. Thank the gods. Right, anyway, yeah, welcome to Epic MMO. As you can see, the MMO mod is in effect. Cool, cool. Turns out if there's monsters nearby when you spawn in, you can just get endurance for free. I mean, obviously, they're not getting you very much. Better. There's another ghost after me! Feck off! Okay. 
I've never played with some of these mods, aka like the Origins mod. I have no idea how good certain mods and stuff are. I picked an arachnid partly because now I can say I was reborn as a spider. Otherly because it actually seemed alright. I don't know. The AV was pretty good. The cat was pretty good. The blades if I didn't have to deal with being in the nether would have been grand. Um, yeah, no, there's a few ones there I could definitely see myself wanting. Why are you still following the several? <laughs> <laughs> Leave me alone! I need to be daytime, please. I need to be fucking daytime. Am I... That ghost still in there? No, my body's just sitting there. Oh, give me that. There we are. Oh, good, it's about to be daytime. Fantastic. That was the first 10 minutes of this video, then. Right, anyway, as I was saying, um... I oh, know, I still climb you, and if I'm not... Oh, wow, I'm gonna get annoyed by that. Uh, right, yeah, I probably, I might as well go for, oh, hold on, slash, Gimbal, the fire take fog, slash, Gimbal, mob griefing fogs, and, Gimbal, the name's achievements, folks, there we go. Right, um, might as well briefly go over this now that we've started fully and all that, so yeah, welcome, mod pack, on server. For great with doing this semi public, as always, if you want to get a chance to get whitelist onto the server, leave a like on the video or your in game name down below for a chance to get on. And if you're a member of the channel, as always, leave your in game name in the comment section. And I'll whitelist you, no bother. Students jump ahead to the queue for the whitelisting, like, gold like, thing. If you're getting get on, chin, that'll leave a thing in the community section, so then get on the usual shebang. Mod pack, you want be out probably around episode 2. Uh, when everyone gets white listed. Right, just to quickly go over some of the mods I'm getting this, because some are different I've not used before, so I don't know how good they are, blah, blah, blah. We'll see, we'll see. Uh, we've got uh, the carts mod, we've got chisel bits, we've got classes, which... That's what we just did, that was Origins, right? Yeah, I think so. Uh, we've got crops mod, cosmetic armor, dungeon crawl, dungeon gear, dungeon mobs, epic fight, fake blocks, fake name. Final Fantasy 12 mobs, Ice and Fire furniture mod, Ice, uh, uh, Iron Chest mod, Iron Visits, Key Slabs, Localized Chat, and the Macaws, uh, stuff, Malazis mobs. Malazis, I think, works. Yeah, 1.60, it works fine. We're fine with that. Wait, I've got classes and I've got origins. The hell? They aren't the same thing? What? The hell? What? Okay, whatever. Uh, I've got, I've got something else that apparently I don't know what it is. Uh, I, I made this pack just recently, but still. Oh, I had some of the stuff already, I suppose. I've got palms, we've got Pandora's Creatures, we've got small ships, swig through grass, slabs, twilight forest, and wall jump. So, dungeons, dragons, and other random bits and pieces. Let's see if we can fight and beat this world. Beat all its little bosses while we're at it. All the while being a spider. Man of sorts. Um... Right, where the hell do I start in this one? So, yeah, this one's not strictly a so much anime type one, but it is more just an MMO based one. Uh, to put it quite simply, I had an idea for this pack back when I was doing the first Demon Slayer. Basically, back when we were doing Epic Fight and I found the MMO for the first time. But back then, I couldn't, like, the, my server provider didn't provide Forge on a version that allowed me to use a lot of the mods, like the Origin mods and stuff like that. Oh, it's later versions. So I was like, now nah, I'll just leave it then. And I ended up waiting, I just ended up doing the Demon Slayer MMO instead. And then Bleach 2 MMO. And yeah, that was fine. Those were fun. Those were good. But now the server has updated all the stuff. These mods have updated some more as well. And there's just lots of fun stuff to do. So I fancy giving it a try. Let's give it a try. Let's do an MMO type series with you lot. Sure, that'll work out fine. I don't, I don't, I don't know how this is gonna go. We can always try it and see. It's been a while since I've done one without some type of anime mod with a theme thing going on, but I'm, I'm sure I'll be alright. Why have I got particles going around me? I get haste. What? Why do I have haste? I don't. Oh. Oh, this will be classes then. Oh! Oh, classes! Oh, classes! It's, it's an add-on to the MMO mod. Now I remember. <laughs> now I remember what it is. Oh! 
I have no idea what I want to be doing here. Hold the boss. Please select your class. You cannot change your class later. We have got Soldier. A wind sword, wind shield, archery plus 5%, combat plus 5%, endurance plus 5%. Tempting. The Freeman. Wind axe, uh, plus 1, wind pickaxe. Uh, excavation, mining, wood cutting plus 5%. Survivalist, fishing rod, apples, cooking, farming, and fishing up. Art Artisan. Uh, building, crafting, and smithing, along with the smithing, table, and oak logs. Adventurer, hay bale, wind sword, agility, swimming, and flying. And in the mage, four ender pearls, 12 bottles of enchanting, alchemy, combat, and magic. Um, I feel like it kind of just has to be soldier, doesn't it? Because, like, getting combat and endurance up quickly is really handy. That said, though, getting mining up is another one. Ooh. Like, some of the other stuff can just be disregarded because no, it doesn't matter. I'll get that stuff up in due time. But yeah, mining and endurance are two really annoying ones to get up. Because, like, mining takes ages and endurance is just... It's endurance, isn't it? You need to get hit by things. Uh, bonus 5% that is... No, it's not nothing. Certainly not nothing, especially to have it this early. Um... Ooh. I think I'm gonna be a soldier. Gonna be a soldier. I... Yeah, there we go. Bonuses. Huzzah! Also, wait, I can use this, right? Yes! I don't have the... I don't have the stupid thing in, do I? <laughs> Huzzah! I don't bloody uh, world edit it this time because it didn't work anyway. I'm free! I can use the thing! Brilliant. Right, so, in theory, that I'm thinking about it as well. Uh, I won't take fall damage as long as I cling to a wall. Right? Like, if I... Imagine falling from here. Okay, I did nothing. Seemed about right for the most part. Uh, Kill, kill, kill. Okay, we need to find a place, make a base of operation. That's one bit. Wait, I put Pams in this. I ain't, I don't think I changed the config for Pams. <laughs> oh, it's a good thing with the food where I've got to like fight with things and make Pams foods. It might, you know. And if it does, I'm just gonna leave it this time. Fails to it, we'll have someone have to be a cook for us then. <laughs> Uh, I'll trade them and other things I managed to collect. Yeah, I'll be interested to see what classes people pick. And I pity the people that decide to pick the, um, thingy class. Uh, the people that decide to pick the plays class. Because I, I don't, like, you're going to start the nether in 1.16. Now, that sounds fun on one hand. But on the other hand, fucking hell, what, like, you're fireproof, yeah? Actually, no, it's not that bad, because you'll be able to get obsidian, won't you? Yeah, you can get obsidian from chests and stuff like that, it's just... You don't have any weapons or anything. <laughs> so I don't I don't know how you're going to survive, but I'm sure someone will try it and figure it out for themselves, I suppose. I kind of wish I'd picked that out. It would have been funny. Um, right, hold on. Let's check. Controls. Boop -doo, wall jump. I already set some of the buttons prior. So yeah, cosmetic armor is that. Social interaction screen. That's pop.mmo's what? That's a social interaction screen. Where are you? I don't know. Give it a try and see. Okay, that's the thing I get the server put as. What? Okay, I don't know what that is, so whatever. Doesn't matter. What else we got? Ba -dum. Achievements now are turned off. Carts and carry me, chisel and bits that are all disabled now. Yeah, because the class is already done, so that's fine. There's an epic fight, inventory, stuff like that. Special attack info, that's for epic fight ones, that doesn't matter, because we already know most of it. If it's, 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 it's. Ah! I took power in that, hold on. Ooh. GH and. Oh, View Origin. Okay, hold on, we can do that. Also, what have we got here? Toggle still, turn off for now. We don't have a boat. Uh, Project MMO, P to open the menu, and then that's all their bits in this V to bring mine. I'll be sure to remember that. Right, yeah, alright, so View Origin, Activate Primary, Activate Secondary. So wait, is that... I'm guessing that's only relevant depending on your... Ah, no, I can turn it off. Ah, okay, that's good, 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 good. Okay, I'm glad I figured that out. I'm glad I figured that out before everyone in the comments section shouts at me. Because <laughs> uh, you probably would have. Uh, Alright, so I can turn off the ability to web people whenever I'm fighting, and I can turn off the ability to... I think we did... 
uh, wall climb all the time, which I'm gonna be honest, if you're like, wall climbing's a very useful ability, but see, I'm like just trying to get through like a forest. I don't wanna turn it off. I don't wanna turn it off at that point, because it can be quite annoying you're trying to get past a tree, and then suddenly you cling to the tree, and you're running away from someone. Alright, and then yeah, view origin. This is your origin. You have multiple origins? I'm seeing that impact low. I guess it would have a low impact apart from the heart, the heart thing. I can see why like a blaze one would be a three impact. Yeah, it makes sense. Same with the um, it, it, that best three because yeah, you end up it starting in the nether. I can imagine that would be, yeah, something. And yeah, on the flip side, the phantom. Yeah, you get to be invisible. You can face the objects and stuff like you're a ghost, but you burn it in the day. Again. Big effect on your day-to-day -day living, wouldn't it? <laughs> yes, I imagine it would, because there you go. Uh, I'm getting cut down to the wood here as I'm talking. I probably should go get some cobble. And there's a thing right off my head. That will be perfect. Let's grab some stone and get some basic tool. Wait, hold on. I can't even use... <laughs> I just remembered. <laughs> I just remembered. Oh, God. Yeah, you can't use stone in that. You've got to build yourself up to it. I've got to get mining, wood cutting, and everything up to level the excavation up to level ten first. I forgot about that. I might as well. I can grab some for a furnace, I suppose, and we'll see what the cooking situation is. I can't get any iron in that yet. That's a fight at the village. And well, you're meant to pace yourself. Also, it's baking you. No, I don't get any farming or anything for that. Go, go. Can't I just eat a strawberry. Can I just eat a thick- Really? You can't just eat them? Oh! Oh yeah, I can't eat them all- Oh yeah, yeah, I'm a carnivore, I've got to eat meat. Makes sense. Why did I get haste again? They went away. Am I just good with an axe? What? Whenever I take out an axe, I get haste. Why? I am not complaining, I'm just really confused. <laughs> not quite sure why I'm getting that benefit. I like that I'm getting it, but I don't understand it. Oh well. Figure out later, I suppose. Uh, another thing, oh yes, yeah, so ice and fire is in this. It's on 1.16, so there could be more stuff in it than what I'm used to. So that'll be fun. Um, Yeah, I need to look out for dragons and stuff. At this early stage, they're very dangerous. <laughs> I don't think I've got any real means to defeat them, so... <laughs> Need to be careful, careful. Also, is that all? Yeah, I've got some coal. Right, hold on, let's make ourselves a wee thingy thing. I was gonna wait until I find a village, but... Eh, it's whatever. Ba -ba -dum. Put... Yep, that in there. That in there. Also, just done, done, mate. Epic fight sin, which you mean, yeah, I better get two-handed things. Huzzah! Huzzah! Now we've got two swords. Now we can fight with... Oh, okay, hold on, there's a skeleton over there, though. Ah, there's a lot of skeletons around here. Hold the bus. Uh, maybe I should fully heal up first. Right, what's this going to do for me? Now I get full thing back from it. Ha! Must be off by default then. Kill kill works for me. Right. I'm not as health though. Stop it. Ha ha! Well. Ow! Oh god, there's a few of them. Ow, ow, ow. Build mode. Eh. Bring it on! In fact, both of you is fine. <laughs> oh god! Alright, we're good. Okay, so the webs are temporary as well. That's pretty handy. Okay, okay, okay. That needs to get turned off. Here, dogs. Uh, no. Oh. Okay, apparently I can turn it off later then. So for now, I've got business to attend to. Wait, how are you able to attack me? You've been webbed. You cannot attack a webbed person! Wait, no. You can't attack when you've been webbed by a person? What? You unlocked dagger! 
How do I get dagger game? How do I which which dagger? There's a few daggers as it turns out. Probably the one from Dungeon Gear. I am sneaky. They can't. <laughs> it's actually true. You can't tell I'm here because I'm sneaky. And now he can. Ah, it's me. Bob. No flat. Right. Grab a sack. It's mostly kicked. Da -da -da. I'm not home. Ow! There we are. You have a locked stone chisel as a weapon. What? I get a weird feeling that's not what I'm going to be using it for, game. Okay? Any more? No? Good. There we are. Lovely, lovely. But yeah. Uh, given the only times we've actually used Epic Fight and MMO and stuff for it so far has been with Demon Slayer and with, um, Bleach Mod. In Demon Slayer, we limited ourselves so we didn't get as much Demon Slayer power-ups, but we were still massively strong compared to the common mob. And we were fighting against demons, which pretty much was a case of either you're going to beat them or you had no chance. Like, there was very little middle ground <laughs> with how powerful they all were. So yeah, that, that was that was an experience for sure. Then in Bleach, we were just way stronger than everything else, pretty much. Like that, that was just it. In this though, this time, yeah, we've got various different things to take on between the ice and fire stuff, between the regular vanilla stuff, between the Twilight Forest, and yeah, with you know, MMO mod ons our classes with our origin. Yeah, it should be interesting to see, can we take on the mobs? Can we build up the gear to actually fight them? Ba da ba da ba. Hurry up and adventure. Plus apparently I'm a spider that only eats meat. So, that'll be fun. Okay, wait, I see a red dot on that map there. Is that... Oh, wait, oh, that's what that is. Um... Yeah, I probably shouldn't fight that, as it turns out. I I, I might be a little under-equipped to face down a giant, giant spider. Like, I mean, technically we're probably from, like, some distant... Um, it's probably some distant relative of mine, technically. Because apparently I'm spider-born. Oh. Yeah, I'll, I'll just take the water. Uh, I need to kill some fish. Not fish. I need... To, could kill some fish. I need to kill some sheep and get a bed. <laughs> that is what I need. Or find a village and steal a bed. Either or works for me. Wait, no, my brethren! Don't do this! You've been caught in my web, huzzah! Ow! Ah! Underwater. And there we heal. My sword broke! Booga! Hold well on. Bum, ba dum, ba dum. There we are, for the fleet. No. Oh yeah, they can't swim very well. Lol. Well, they'll turn into drowns soon enough. Okay, yeah, moving on. Bam, ba -dum, ba -dum, ba -dum. You know, I'm really glad that thing doesn't go for you. <laughs> I just thought it was going to you You, you are not violent, you're friendly. Unless I hit you, then you'll absolutely destroy me. No, I'm not dealing with it. No, I'm not. I refuse. Is there a village nearby? It feels like there's not. Oh dear. That's unfortunate. But here, you have to deal with ghosts at least. Don't feel like dealing with them again. Ba -ba -dum. Right. Up we go. Sheep! Exactly what. No, bugger off! Um. Okay, yeah, there's my planes battle over there. We're going around the mountain. Ow! Ah! How'd you get up there? Jump! Ah! Okay, wait, that was silly. I just remembered the wall climb. Turn the wall climbing on. Turn the wall climbing on. You can climb things that actually can't be climbed. Scale everything. Ah! If I had wall climbing on, I could have cling to that tree and not battle my shins in there. Would have been great. Should have done it. Oh! Roll! Roll! Roll, you fool! Roll! Find the tree. Oh, they're coming. 
go, 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 go. Please stop it back in your bay. <laughs> How interesting the Rory from Skeletons are just a dragon hiding out in the, well, not really hiding so much, but just, you know, chilling out in the middle of the plains by them, ready to cook me alive. All right, yeah, get the will for a bed. Quickly now, quickly. I don't think I'm being pursued anymore. I think we're good. Let's go kill this while I'm here. No flip. No! What the buggery is that? I don't know. I'm gonna go look at it. Oh, wait, no, I do know what that is. I do know what that is. I do know what that is. It's, it's an illager thing. Illager just lives there. It's an illager! Oh, God! Wait a minute. You. Okay, that actually hurt quite a bit. I was supposed to say, you almost shoot arrows. I can, I can fight you with my sword and it'll be fine. I don't feel like testing that theory, though. If he shoots me too many times, I will die. Uh, I just want to fight a village. I want to deal with the giant spiders and that. But, but, uh, at least I can outpace everything. Oh, <laughs> uh, God, if I'd been an avian, I could have moved even quicker. Then again, I don't know how useful Slowfall would be all the time. I reckon that would slow down my jump running. Those illusions are still chasing me! Oh my god, they actually are still coming after me! <laughs> okay, they're giving up now. Good, because I, I. They have given up, right? I think so. Oh yeah, as usual, people though, for server and mod pack and whatnot. Oh, what is. Oh, I know what that is, actually. Um, yeah, as usual, people, if you've got any suggestions for mods you think I should add in, let us know in the comment section down below. Bear in mind again, though, this is 1.16, so certain mods aren't available. Da, 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 da. So just check the mod you're going to recommend. This is 1.16, please, first. Would be handy. Oh, yeah, this is a dungeon crawler. It's a dungeon. I have to reach the bottom of it. That's one of the things on the checklist to do. We should make a checklist of things to do. I've said I've spoken into existence now. Yeah, we should make a list of things to try and do in this if we are doing MMO thing. What well, stuff we want to do? I don't know, be, obviously, beat certain bosses and stuff like that would be one thing. I might catch myself in a tree there and missed. <laughs> Completely misjudged the distance on that one! Ow! Fucking hell! Yeah, you can make a checklist of all the various things you want to do. Like, obviously, things like beat the Ender Dragon, beat the Wither, beat the Guardian. Those make all these sense. It's going to be a bit tough doing that last one if you're a Blazeborn, but, you know, or an Enderborn. But, um, yeah. It's me as a spider, I can do those things. And then I say for now, there's things like the Twilight Forest bosses. Yeah. There's the big dungeons there. Yep. Yeah. All the dungeon gear as well. I don't know what you can do with dungeon gear. Also, oh yeah, dagger and that. Um, yeah, it's totally gonna be that dagger. We can I use? Yeah, that's called Iron Dagger. Combat 29. Fucking hell. I don't even know if you can get these ones yet. I had them in, but I guess we'll find out later on. Uh, Combat 20. Yeah, Combat 5 for basic dagger. Daggers are a weapon of cravens. Or so folks say. Dual wield. 3 damage, 2.5 attack speed, minus 1 reach, minus 1 reach distance. Can't craft it, but I, mean, I assume you can find or trade it from somewhere then. Maybe. I don't know. I uh, guess we'll find out at some point. Right, where am I currently? I feel like I've taken a wrong tub. It did says. I don't know. At this point, my current venture is to find a village. It's an obvious starting point on a lot of things in Minecraft. So we find a village, we plunder it for its goods, we don't get obsessed with doing trades with villagers. We've done that before, let's not do that again. <laughs> as tempting as it might be to get into village management mode, let's not do that. I might do that, I might do that off camera, and nobody can stop me doing it. But the bar. Probably not something I should be spending all my time on. Oh well, never mind. Let's just see what I end up doing, I suppose. Ba -ba -da. Doggos. Uh, 
Yeah, okay, go down here. Let's, I don't know if this is more ocean here, well, I'm just running at nothing now, but we'll, we'll go and look and see. Nothing else. Wait! Ooh, there'll be a bed down there, actually. Also, I keep toggling my thingy points trying to zoom in. Is there a zoom function? I don't see a zoom function. I don't think there is one. Okay. Well, in any case, uh, yeah, can we turn that off, please? It's kind of annoying toggling on my view, put my death points on and off. Like, I'm, I'm used to Z, Z being zoom. It not being a bit of a pain. Never mind. Hey, uh, yeah, hold on. There should be a bed down here. Along with other things. I want to see the dungeon chests now. I want to see if we've got some stuff in them. Just spider claim it then. And ba -da -da -ba -da. There we are. Is this silly? Probably. Gonna do it anyway though. I want to see, I want to see what's down here. I can't see, can't see a bloody thing. Um, There. How deep down will this take us? Been a while since I've done this mod. YOLO! Right, uh, this one out looks partially safe. Sure, let's go this way. I swear to God, I was about to say, see if the game tells me I'm not allowed to make these. I'll be a bit annoyed. Ah, the bell! Oh! Little nightmare. Get away. Uh, uh, oh, I have been down the wrong pathway. I thought this is one with doors. It may have a spawner at the side somewhere. I don't see a spawner. I think we're fine. Hello. Oh, dear. Well, you're looking fancy, sir. Whew. Okay, that was unfortunate. Oh, God, not again. Uh, right, hold on. That that zombie had a lot of stuff going on with it there. <laughs> okay, I think he had some unique armor on. So I'm guessing, yeah, the dungeon. I'm guessing that's the Minecraft dungeon mods. But yeah, I think it's maybe based off the dungeons game for Minecraft. I uh, big gear and weapons and stuff from it. I think. So can I try this once again? Cause I thought it'd be that'd be fun for an MMO type thing. Make the most sense. But we'll see now. We'll see. If we'll, see we'll see what happens. If I've went the wrong way, haven't I? Ah, the ball. I don't know. That, wait, where, where am I currently? I am currently here. Okay. Yes. In that case, this death point is useless to me. I do down there. No. Yes. It's that one over there. Okay. We'll go to this death point and try and get our stuff back. Right, we're back. The monsters do not appear to be guarding my body, but you never know. I'm just gonna sneak my way towards the I can actually build this click the transfer, but I quickly get my stuff, it should be fine. Let's quickly nip in here and transfer. Lovely. Now we'll just sneak away like we're never here. <laughs> Cause sneaking's a thing, sneaking's a thing you can do apparently. Alright, hold hold on, hold on! Hold on! Hold on! I wasn't ready for all this game! Okay, that's silver, that's copper... Two-handed... A corruption... What the hell? Where are you from? Dungeon gear! The corruption beacon holds immense power within! It waits for the moment and unleashes its wrath! Plus one XP gathering! Gather one XP per use. What?! What have I just picked up? I don't know. Uh, Two-handed, those who face snow. Uh, I'm guessing you're also from Dungeon Gear. Yeah, all right. So Dungeon Gear, you can just find in Dungeon Chess. Fantastic. I'm glad that's integrated in. That's cool. Okay. Um, That thing I picked up. <laughs> is, that, is that anything? What do you do with it? One XP guy requires one XP to use. What? Might be silly not to try and use it. Ah! <laughs> I picked up the laser. What? Oh, please have a bed in here. I could really use a bed. I need a respawn point that's not next to the gogs. Please, game. 
But there must, there must be one nearby. <laughs> also, ran out of torches. Uh, what we got here? Got a master bow there. Dexter three. What have I picked up? Frost helmet, weight five, bit of the two armor, two to armor toughness. Uh, slunker chest plate, endurance there acquired. Slunker armor is worn by those brave to do the dips underworld. Gives you a bat pit. Armor six, range plus 10%, attack damage plus 10%. Free resistance plus 25%. Master's bow, archery 25. Wait, what? The bow preferred by the masters of the archery across the overworld. No matter how simple it appears, pets attack target mobs. X damage dealt, power one. Neat. Picking up all the fun gear, apparently. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna be honest. I don't. I don't think I'm ready to be down here. Uh, uh, I am feeling like maybe I should strategically retreat. Back off for a bit. And come back later. I've got a bit more stuff. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah, we're leaving. We're leaving. We're leaving. <laughs> Sealed. <laughs> yeah, I'm not dealing with that. Look, I just wanted to find a fucking bed, okay? I didn't want none of this. I don't want any of this nonsense. I don't want to be fighting everything. I do have a laser, though. But I don't have a speed of power, though, do I? Apparently, it requires a speed of power, the fucking thing. Oh my god, because I'm a spider, I can't eat cake! Ah! Oh. That's a shame. <gasps> Dead! Oh, we're good. Uh. What? The hell is that? Oh, so. Ah! Oh. <laughs> uh, partly, it's partly a good thing that I've got the thingy modding, because now I can't just come down here. Curse of Vanishing. That's a bit sad. Uh, now I can't just come down here and, like, grab said diamond shovel from here and just use it straight away. Now I'm going to have to wait until I'm, like, off level to use it. Neat, neat, neat. Yeah, okay. Uh, we are totally, totally... Oh, I'll be having... Actually, uh, yeah, we'll kick stuff while I'm here. Da -da -da -da. Any mobs fall their heads? Oh, the bloody is as well as the spawner. Uh oh, I can fire back! Ah! It actually worked. <laughs> oh, it's your ability, though. Oh God. Okay. That was fun. It's fun while that lasted. I'm, I'm glad I got to try that, if nothing else. There's a main minecart in here. Level 10 smithing the salvage. Why is there a minecart just lying in here? There's a bloody bomb minecart in here. What? Why? Why is there TNT in a bomb minecart? That's a bit odd. Uh, okay, so yeah, dungeons have got a, a, a bunch of unique gear, though. So it's totally worth coming and sniffing around. Get up finding some fun things. Of course, there is the dangers that come with. Hello there. Ooh, food. Ow. Uh oh. No! Now we're trapped inside together! Not anymore. Okay, apparently, apparently, apparently there's a creeper spawner on our head. <laughs> I'll just wait for them to sort off and I will be fine. I can't use the smoker! Ah! Playing this dangerous game of chicken right now. I know you're there. Ah! You can't explode if I'm studying. I can't even see what the feck I was doing there. I can eat cake! Haha! -ha! <laughs> I don't know why I can eat cake. I shouldn't be allowed to. Um, uh, doll feck. 
Bop. That'll do it. Uh, right, hold on. Thanks, 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 thanks. Uh, make a door. Eh. Uh, just toss things down. There we are. Right. Doors are down. Also, also... Bed. Hate that. Hate that, sir. Hate it so much. Uh, is it only... Yeah, it's only what I've currently got. Okay, yeah. Grab, grab bed, please. Thank you. Alright, you know, you can, you, know, you, know, you can keep, you can keep the main cart. I don't really want it. Keep that as well, actually. Alright, I'm gonna sleep in this bed now, so if I do die, I end up back here. Which I honestly would prefer. Also, since I can do that, that clearly means it's currently night time, so now it's not. Right, there we go. What the? Right, we found some neat stuff. But right, I think for today, <laughs> go wrap things up there. <laughs> so, 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 so. Oh, I've not even got space to put stuff in off on the way. I can put that in off on oh. But yeah, anyway, people, thank you all very much for watching. Hope you all enjoyed the show. Welcome to the epic, epic, oh, epic MMO series. And yeah, hope this will be a bit of fun. Uh, Minecraft stuff, Dungeon Gear. Get any suggestions for extra things to put in, let us know in the comment section down below. For episode 2, I make some adjustments of any fun mods I can add in. Uh, but yeah, just trying something a bit different. Some mods that we've used before, but I've not used them on 1.16 in some cases. Uh, fun combination it means we're not really overpowered. So things like Twilight Forest and Dragon stuff should actually be quite challenging. So that could be fun, we'll see. But hey, anyway, thank you all for watching. I shall see you all next time for more of this little adventure. Did I make Dungeon Dive? I might run away from here. We we'll should find out. Well, I, I kind of feel like I, need, I can't really delve any deeper. I really can't. I've not got the armor. I need to go train. I need to go to training montage. Then I'll return. Then I'll conquer Dungeon. By the time I do that, someone else will already conquered it. So it'll be much easier. I'll just walk down with any challenge. Ah, uh, fair one fresh until that point. But anyway, right, thank you for watching. See you next time for more of this. Go buy it from Buddy. Da, 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 da. Also, just want to say a quick thank you to all of the channel members for the extra support and a special thank you and shout out to our lead members, the Johnny members Austin Quinsenberry, Sebastian Ramsey, Silhorn, Alexander, Nolfinity, and Dagger. And our honorable members, Gold Dragon, Aragon, Colton Woods, and Banish Gaming 23. Thank you all very much for the extra awesome support. Butter, butter, butter.